What's up? Welcome to another timepiece review, Tony's timepiece review. And today I've got the Tissot PRX quartz model. Um, and I initially was going to get the automatic, but you can't get the automatic right now. I guess it's, I don't know if it's out or if there's just a backlog on it. The guy told me it was just a lot of backlog on it. And to be honest with you, I, I wasn't going to buy a quartz watch. You know, I was, I was really wanted to buy, you know, I'm, I'm really just into automatic watches, not so much quartz watch and watches, but, uh, in this case, um, I bought this from the timepiece network. That's at the Burbank mall, Burbank, California if you've uh in the area and i got great service from the guy who sold me the watch his name is dick ron uh can't pronounce his last name but uh i went in there first and foremost looking for the prx automatic he didn't didn't have them um then he said he had the quartz models so i was like man i was wanted to buy a c-star with a ceramic bezel anyway so i was probably just gonna buy the c-star um, but when he showed me this, I was like, wow, this thing looks beautiful. I mean, at the price point, not just the price point, I mean, this watch has got this beautiful band. I mean, for the, it's, and it's super comfortable. Um, sorry, I'm kind of all over the place with this thing. I haven't, uh, okay, so I, I just put it on, put it on the wrist. I really like it. Um, it's kind of an homage to well, a lot of people say the Royal Oak. I don't know. And then the, the Vacheron Constantine overseas, which that's my style. Um, but the cool thing about the Tissot uh, PRX is that this watch first came out in the 1970s, I think 1978. And just uh, so they're really an homage to themselves in a sense, aren't they? Um, it's super comfortable um has its quartz i'm so i'm assuming it's an eta movement they're owned by the swatch group tiso yeah um 40 millimeter case i think my wrist is like seven and a half inches um so it fits on my wrist really well um no over doesn't hang over the lugs don't hang over um and i love this the strap it's again sort of also like the the rolex oyster quartz um and for the price, okay, so this thing retails at $375, okay. The automatic retails at $650. He hooked me up with a really good deal on this, all right. I got it for $325 um, out the door. I think it was out, yeah, $325 out the door. Um, so initially, if, if I would have bought it, I would have probably just bought it on Amazon, but I'm like, nah, so I just... Um, so I just bought it, 40, 40 millimeter case, um, 100 meters water resistance, which is pretty cool, um, sapphire crystal, and it fits and wears really, really well. And it looks like it could be way more. I mean, this looks like, um, you know, it could be in the thousands of dollars, you know, really, but uh, not with the quartz movement, but uh, so would, would I buy the automatic over the quartz? I mean, so essentially you're getting the same watch with just an automatic movement. You're going to pay about $300 more. Um, so that's, that's your call. Plus I think the automatic has a waffle type dial. Um, I'm a, um, yeah, dial. So other than that, I'm trying to think I'm just winging it. It comes in. It's nice packaging. Um, and a lot of, a lot of books in the back there. So if you, want to have a little bit of late night reading or whatever um but i just got it i just got home so i i do like it if you have any questions let me know because i'm kind of you know i'm not a an aficionado on on uh tiso um this is actually my first tiso um but i can tell you i'm super satisfied especially with the price you can't beat it it's a good beater watch you know go go in the water with it not worry about it banging around and you're you're fine because you're not out you know if you if you break it you know it's really not that much money so having said that uh this was just a short review uh it's not really that thorough it doesn't have a screw down a screw on crown you know so it's push pull um snap on case back and other than that yeah i love it so thanks for watching